Wang. <clears throat> and now here's our featured presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to welcome you to today's Society of Decision Professionals Learning Exchange. My name is Hilda Traction, and I have the pleasure of introducing today's presentation. I love DA, I just wish we didn't have to deal with people. I would now like to introduce to the, you to the speakers you will be hearing from today. Our featured speaker is Stuart Harris. Stuart has over 20 years' experience in the pharmaceutical industry, including 14 years at GlaxoSmithKline, where he headed the Decision Sciences Department. Since retiring from GSK, he has worked primarily with decision frameworks and performed consulting and teaching services with major pharmaceuticals and biotech firms. He received his PhD from Wharton School of the University of Pennsylvania. Stuart, welcome to today's learning exchange. Thank you very much. I would also like to introduce Eric Johnson. Eric Johnson is Associate Director of Decision Analysis at Bristol Myers Squibb, where he leads teams to find a valuable ways to develop their compounds. Eric is a fellow and board member in the Society of Decision Professionals and chairman of SDP's Knowledge Sharing Coordination Council. Eric, welcome to today's learning exchange. Thank you very much, Elda. Looking forward to it. Eric will be moderating today's presentation and uh, fielding your questions to Stuart. And now, without any further delay, I'd like to turn today's presentation over to our featured speaker, Stuart Harris. Stuart, you have the floor. Okay, thank you very much, Elda. Uh, first, just one mention. Um, if somebody does want to ask a question, Eric, feel free to interrupt me. I don't mind at all. <clears throat> Very good, thanks. Um, okay. You don't have to hold them to the end, in other words. Um, and the title of this, I love decision analysis. I just wish it didn't involve people. Uh, I know this was attributed to me, but actually <laughs> I have to attribute it to somebody who reported to me. Uh, it was the first person I hired, and I went down to his desk. He was... He was, a, he was really good technically. He was very good. And he was look, looking a little depressed. He asked him what's wrong, and he just looked up at me, and he said, I just love decision analysis. I just wish it didn't involve people. 